you want that fire, that uh, handgun, to uh, uh, want that self is a criminal. The one that took the video is also a criminal. But there are two persons who are businessmen who uploaded the video. They are also criminals. Because why did they, they, they upload that video? Uh, maybe they, they said that they have good intention. But good intention does not always result in good consequences. This time, by uploading the video, then it has generated outrage. It has generated emotions all over this country. Kanina po, I, I, uh, I heard you say that yung nag-upload ng video is a criminal. So how do I describe it? What crime how do I propose? Sir, what crime did he violate? Uh, it's bringing darkness. That is not a crime. Why? It is dark, sir. The, the video, if it was the truth, is that darkness or is that spreading the truth? But that, if, that is... Uh, creating uh, intrigues, creating uh, outrages. Sir, if the truth creates intrigues, it is because it is the truth. If it is a falsity, kung ang video po ay peke, crime po yun. Pero kung totoo po yun, duty ng isang citizen na i-inform lahat. So kung totoo po nangyari yun, sasabihin nyo criminal po yun nag-upload, then how can you say that the BBL and the MRS is ready for democracy kung tatawagin yung kriminal ang kahit sino mag-upload ng laban sa iyong paniniwala. So, authorized ba yung dalawa na yun na i-upload yung... Yes, sir. Under the Philippine, Philippine Constitution, freedom of speech, anyone can be a journalist in the internet. Even, so, if, it, even if the impact is uh, creating uh, intrigues among people? Yes, for as long as it is... For, yes, sir. Especially if it's the truth. Well, uh, this is where there, there's an artist that uh, kind of... Uh, uh, uploading of that uh, weird uh, images, images is not in good sir, not in good sir the weird images is bad if it is false but if it's actual footage na nangyari talaga it is news 